What chops your cheese? Listen, man, New York. New York is chopping my cheese. Right what happened? What happened? That's why you got an LA hat on? New York, yeah, facts. New York lifted some restrictions due to, you know, COVID going in the right direction. Mm-hmm. So now, public public places, you don't need a, a mask. wear a mask mm-hmm. or a vaccine validation. Right? You don't need to. You're the, you don't got to show your card no more. Right. Over the weekend, Mr. Kyrie Irving. This is what chops my cheese. Mr. Kyrie Irving hasn't been able to play in New York because of that, you know, that rule. I well, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna kind of clarify the two uh, rules. There's a public rule and a private employee rule. A public I'm and a private. Yeah. Private so sector unfortunately, private. Kyrie Irving still falls in that private sector law where he still has to be a uh, employee that is vaccinated. vaccinated. Yeah. So he still works, you know, for the NBA, Brooklyn Nets, blah blah blah. He still works for them. So he still is required to be a, a vaccinated employee. But what chops my cheese is, visually, it doesn't make sense. Kyrie no. Irving sat side, you know, on the side of the court while the Nets played at home. For two no mask. Two. Hmm? He was at the college game Yeah, the day before, and then he was, was at Duke, the Nets right? game. Mm-hmm. Was and he's was playing. And he's in Barclays Center. He's there, right? Sitting courtside, watching his team play courtside, no mask on, but he's not allowed to play. Visually, it just makes no sense, right? Tons of people are around in the stadium, not vaccinated. Uh, some players, I think, in New York, the some players coming in. Yeah, if if you're an away from an away team, you don't have to be vaccinated. Exactly, doesn't you know? It just doesn't all align for some reason, and like they're making it a very difficult like situation for like the Brooklyn Nets. Obviously this is let's say you work in an office, you know, I get it, right? It's an office space, everyone's vaccinated. You're not really seeing that much outsiders, blah, blah, blah. But to see it in action at the, you know, at the arena and him sitting there, it's just it's just like visually it doesn't make sense. He should be allowed to stand on the court with his teammates. You know absolutely I, mean? I think the rule I think if the rule was nobody was allowed to play then I could see like okay that that makes more right. sense like even mm-hmm. if you're from a different t- if you're from a different state because for me it's only hypocritical from the standpoint of another person can play but I can understand the rule why being in place or whatever like you know cool but I just think it's hypocritical when you have somebody else yeah. from, from like maybe Texas or something who's unvaccinated playing and Kyrie Irving can't play you know so to me it doesn't make sense visually it just visually yeah. when you see it it's just like yo this man hasn't played all year and now he's sitting there courtside and he still can't play he actually went into the locker room he got, they got with fined. the team and they got fined fifty thousand dollars the brooklyn nets got he didn't get fined personally the brooklyn nets, the brooklyn nets got fined fifty thousand dollars for him being there i think they're trying to do a power play the nets they are i agree the mayor, but i it's a slippery slope because you know how politicians are mm-hmm. you try to show them up in public they're going to be very vindictive and be like all right like, yeah i'm not doing shit i don't care like you and, and it's the nets they're not the knicks you know, Stephen A. made a point, like, yo, if they were the Knicks, because, you know, New York is a Knicks town. Like, yep, exactly. That shit would have been, especially had a winning team, that mandate would have been lifted. So well, that's a fact. I talked about this with uh, somebody else, and they made a good point, you know, obviously that kind of contradicts what I'm saying. But, you know, all the employees who work there. Mm-hmm. That's what all, I was going to bring they up. They all yeah. had yes. to be vaccinated, yes. right? So the vendors, the hot dog guy. Everyone has to be vaccinated, so it even almost the, seems even like the a, glizzy giver, even the glizzy <laughs> giver. <laughs> popcorn, so it popcorn. almost seems like Kyrie gets special treatment if he is yes. allowed to play. And they could I was going to say that mm-hmm. the people it's that unfair. got fired, yeah, they could be like, yo, they could use that as a reason to sue. Like, oh, you you let Kyrie Irving play, and I got fired, so I'm suing you because I lost my job, and now you and that, yeah, right. Exactly. It's yeah. not fair to the exactly. people who actually had to give yeah, up their jobs exactly. to, to or not work there, or people who haven't who had to get vaccinated to keep their job. So it could be. So that's crazy. why New York, because New York is kind of the the holder of all of this. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think New York should kind of relook at this rule and kind of. Obviously, there's going to be va- tons of variations, but in but an arena in a public setting like that, you, that's kind of crazy. What do you do though? Like, yeah, I was going to say you got to look from think? it like from both perspectives. Like the mayor, let's say he says, "All right, like I'm cutting up the rule." Like obviously, as sports fans, we would love that. Mm-hmm. But then, like if you're a person at home who lost your job, or another person who didn't want to get vaccinated but did it. Because you have bills to pay, and New York is hella expensive. Yeah. Then you got to be like, yo, fuck that. Like, fuck, like you let Kyrie Irving play, who got who's a millionaire, and I got to, I had to get back. That's what I'm saying. Not just let him play, do. but adjust that law, and at least do some kind of public assembly, public assembly, um, you know, 
bypass or something like because visually it just don't make sense yeah right if the if the the rule is to protect the people Mm -hmm. it don't make sense inside of an arena like it just don't make sense yeah there's been a lot of hypocrisy with this yeah oh oh, oh, yeah and it's 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 confusing to a lot of people but it chops my cheese get that shit give Kyrie his job back (laughs) and then all for the people who got who you fired Uh, their job back (laughs) you know give him a little bit of extra cash say Mm -hmm. listen you you offered your job back we'll give you some extra cash hey buddy and everything is all (laughs) under the rug New York makes its money because Kyrie is playing. Mm-hmm. Give them another stimulus package. Facts. Yo, Melo, come in. You know them? Uh, they look kind of familiar. Yo, Austin, come look at this. Yo, who is that? Ooh. Yo, Gus, Kyrie. What happened? Yo, look at this. What happened? What? What are we looking at? Who Yo, what's wrong with them? Wrong with them? Who the hell? Oh, I get it. What? They're not subscribed. Ah. Ah.